Twitch. Go to Twitch and wait for the Twitch to initiate. And we are live. So, hello everyone. Welcome to the, my first impression stream of Kingdom Come. Now, before we do anything... Oh god. I just need to lower all of the things. Because this game is very loud. And for some reason it is louder than when I tried it before. Okay, shut up. <laughs> so yeah, this here is... You could say that this is a very important uh, game to me. Because you see, as uh, some of you may know, I am from uh, Czechia, you know, from Czech Republic. And this is the biggest, most expensive and the most ambitious game that ever came out from my country. The second one, probably Mafia. And just... Just listening to the music is really nice in this game. You know, I'm, 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 I'm not gonna be biased. If anything, I would judge this game even more harshly. For instance, that it keeps changing my audio. Please, please stop. Please. Okay. <laughs> it's a professional streamer. Anyway, so yeah. Uh, this here is a medieval RPG. Uh, I believe it is supposed to be kind of very similar to Mountain Blade. That means there will be no magic, there will be no, like, weird bullshit happening. This is just gonna be swords, horses, arrows, and... Uh, basically a very realistic, almost hyper-realistic uh, medieval life. This is something I'm really interested in, because we do not get those games at all. And I'm interested in how they are going to make it interesting, because even Witcher 3 was honestly only interesting because of the, you know, like the magic and the creatures and such. And none of that is going to be in this game. This is just going to be people being people. Also, I'm playing on pretty low settings, uh, because one, my computer is shit, and two, this game has been reported by many as being very very badly optimized which you know they can deal with you know with patches and such but yeah uh, I will, I'm gonna start this game on uh, low settings and you know I will try to up it but you know it's very hard to actually you know test a first impression video anyway let us start it You can, see, you can see the FPS in the corner. It's gonna be like literally the, the, the craziest shit ever. Also, the company who made this is literally called War Horse because of course. The early 15th century was a time of turmoil in the Holy Roman Empire, which had flourished under the late Emperor Charles IV. But now, with his son Wenceslas the Idol. No! The king's inactivity angered many of the nobility, as well as half-brother, King Sig Sigmund of Hungary. No! That goes away too quickly. God damn it. Oh dear. Cerebral Skelets, 1403. Oh, they mean Skelet Horror. Okay, I get it. Holy shit, this game is really set in Czech Republic. Or oh, more like Bohemia. Oh, kick my ass for that. Okay, I have to say, they kinda got, like, the nature and such of that area pretty well. But again, this is a cutscene. So, who is this guy supposed to be? Oh, by the way, I am also a hi I have done a lot of history. 
I actually was on um, half diplomacy, half history, um, high school, and I have done medieval fencing. I am extremely into history. So I would judge the, his the historical accuracy of this game very harshly. Boris. Well, husband, how goes it? Good. I should get it finished today. Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. <laughs> he was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour? Blue-blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, drinking like a lord. <laughs> you go and get the lazy bones up then. A quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. So seems like our character is a son of a blacksmith. That, that's a pretty good thing, you know, like blacksmiths, uh, they earned a lot of money Get up now. during this time, especially if they were good. But they could also very easily die. Get up or I'll come get you up, you slug of egg. <laughs> Hear that? You'd better not vex him. Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Now don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself is all. Hmm, well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. Yeah, so sword play is a big deal because peasants were not even allowed to be able to learn how to defend themselves with swords. And if peasant was actually wielding really something, it would usually be like an axe. A fine state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? Oh, immediately choices. Uh, by the means of first two choices in this dialogue, you both select your character's default characteristics. If you're not satisfied with them, do not worry. All characters can be further developed without limitations. Okay, so we were chatting at the top. Oh, okay, so this will increase kind of like my stats, I presume. And again, uh, what you see right now is basically the lowest possible settings that you can play this game on. So it only gets better. You know, like this, like if you want to see someone like actually like record properly in like 4K, uh, I'm sure there's YouTube videos that actually do that. I've seen how beautiful this game gets, and it gets really beautiful. It was Bianca. <laughs> I was working in the forge. I was dancing in ability, okay? We were chatting in the tavern. I wonder if you can, like, actually do, like, a, a speech character. That would be interesting. But, yeah, let's go for that. Uh, nothing much. Me and the lads were just having a chat in the tavern. Some wayfarer stopped by. He was telling us what's going on in the world, and, um, well, I, uh, I lost track of time. Well, I hope you didn't fill your head with nonsense. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand, and that suspicious-looking character with a sword who's turned up in town recently. Okay. Why would I be interested in sword fighting? Mephias was teaching me archery. I was with Bianca. Oh, what it doesn't matter. You know what? Yeah, let's increase our speech even more. You think he's teaching me sword fighting, don't you? What use would that be to me? Here. I'm not lying to you, Matt. All right, then, if you say so. I don't hey, Zoology, to welcome to the stream. But you know your father takes a dim view of such things. Okay. I'm hungry. <laughs> so, have my friends been here? Yeah, let's just ask about friends and such. Uh, we look kind of young. I would guess about 14, maybe 15. I would guess. Did Matthew and Fritz come looking for me? 
No, I haven't Fruits. seen them this morning. They shouldn't be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. Yeah, you're misjudging them. You know, the, the, uh, to be honest, people at this point were probably like young people had nothing better to do than to like beat each other and, you know, just run, you know, trying to catch rabbits and shit. Yeah, you are misjudging them. That's unfair. Really? So where were you until the small hours last night? I was with Bianca, of course. You mean at Bianca's tavern? And who was there with you? No, don't tell me. Let me guess. Not hey, Jack, uh, Jack Twitch, welcome to stream. Well, at least you were with Bianca. You should hold on to that one, Hal. She's a. I hope it will deliver. And invite her for supper sometime. Your father. This is the most important game of my country ever made. Be able to it has to deliver. Beer brewing out of her. <laughs> You're right there. You'd think he was planning to become a brewer in his dotage. Still, that's your father for you. At least he's interested in something, unlike you lot. <laughs> You're too busy getting into mischief to do an honest day's work. If Fritz and Matthew carry on this way, they'll wind up swinging one day. You mark my words. Uh, hey, check, check this game out. Oh, God damn it! Okay, so... Yeah, it's all for... I don't know, so far the voice acting is pretty okay, and the animations are not bad, as, uh, you know, so far. And this is on the lowest possible settings. Like, even, there is like a setting for animation, and that one is on low as well, because this game has a horrible optimization. Uh, yeah, is my father hungry? Father angry with me for sleeping late. He most likely is. not happy. Yesterday you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Sir Radzik. God damn it. We are playing a real lazy character. You know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain, but he needs your help, Henry. I know. Don't worry, Ma. Of course I'll help him. Good. He always says his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. Game. I'm hungry. To eat. I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. <laughs> yeah, let's ask her if she needs any help. You need me to do anything, Ma? Ah, you're a good lad. But I'm fine. It's your father needs helping with that sword. Okay, so let's end a dialogue. Okay, so... Oh, Jesus, the sensitivity! Okay, you move around, uh, you sprint, jump, and can wove a caps lock. You can interact with the world using the E, so basically it's... Oh, Jesus, the sensitivity! Give me a second, I need to lower my DPI. Hey, Spekar, welcome to the stream. But they certainly have staring into the abyss covered. <laughs> hey, guy, wow! Wait, 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 there is animation for when. Guys, there is an actual animation when you pick up shit. Wait, does it work for everything? Oh my god, it does. No way. Can I pick up that apple as well? Oh my god. Oh my god. Red roll. Give me a second. Give me a second. We, we will defeat this table. A lentil soup. Oh. I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. Good. Animation for stealing everything? Heresy. <laughs> so how is everyone? How was your day? Can I pick up the... Can I pick up these? No, I cannot. Oh, wait. I can sit down? Wait. Okay, this is how I was supposed to take it. I was supposed to... I am retarded. Wait. Inventory? Oh, okay. Oh, no. Look at the stats. Okay, so you do get levels. Visibility. Conspicuousness. What? Really? It is a measure of how you stand in over whether you or not you. Why is it depends on your clothing? Really? No way. <laughs> no way. Every fourth level up. Okay. Combat axe warfare. Warfare? Okay. 
Okay. So it does the whole uh, mountain blade thing. Hey Fingo, so what's this game? Uh, so first, hey, it's Chairshock, welcome to the stream. Uh, this is a checkmate uh, RPG, which is basically a hyper-realistic uh, medieval RPG. And uh, this is like the last and biggest chance of uh, our country to actually, you know, get on the gaming market. God, maces. Skills. Oh no, drinking is a skill? Look, is still resistant to nefarious effects of alcohol. <laughs> you can tell it's, it's 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 a Slavic game because drinking is a fucking skill. Reading, really? Oh wait, did that make sense? Because a lot of people during this time they did not even know how to read, so it doesn't make fucking sense. Hunting buffs. I love how it calls it buffs. Police statistics. Oh my god, this is like a wet dream of mine right now. Health nourishment. Okay. Horse. I don't have a horse. Best luck. Two banjos, run. <laughs> Kingdom come. Do you are is a mix of warband and oblivion? Yeah, I can tell. Okay, go to the sword fighting lesson. I love how we were not even told to do that. Okay, so how do you E? Oh, that's how. You press E. Nom 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 nom. Okay, so how do I leave this? Uh, okay. So I, I ate. Uh, you get up with escape, okay. I was expecting tab later, but okay. Okay, so far the animations are not bad. Can I pick up this broom and be the broom master? Cool. Open chest. Nails for Teresa. Bandage. Barrigo de decoction? Cure light wounds and dispel hangover effects. Okay. So I want to take that. Yes. And I definitely want to take that. Okay. Okay. Wait, wait. Can I open the bags? No. In the. Can I like. You can probably like move shit around. Okay. Onion. That is... That's... Holy shit, this game actually got carrots right. What the fuck is this? A lockpick. Jesus. Why would I lockpick my own fucking house? Okay. Opens the door. Okay, so give me a second. I'm actually gonna do a little thingy. I'm gonna try... Increase a few things. So, no motion blur. Motion blur is literally cancer. Window light, textures on medium, data quality medium, physics medium, lightning medium, particles medium. Let's just have like most of the game on medium. Let's just try to increase the quality. Yes. Let's check, most games are made in America and our carrots are orange. <laughs> yeah, our carrots are yellow. Or green. So this is Slavic Oblivion. <laughs> Can you have sex though? I don't know, I don't know anything about this game. Okay, so... Is the game tanking now? No, it's not. It looks like... Ooh, it is kind of like tanking. Oh. But hey. Ooh, who, who needs 60 FPS? I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. Wow, seriously, dude? Oh, what what is this? Fallout 4? You know, we need to keep eating. Um uh, okay, so. Uh eat that. That. Eat that and eat that. 
also e dead and e dead e dead dead e dead surely you will not complain about being hungry now anyway let's talk to the to the father hello father what's the matter with you henry didn't you hear me calling you Ooh, what the fuck? Uh, sometimes you need powers of persuasion to achieve your goals, but talking to people, you can often... Uh, okay. So simply use speech, which, however, is influenced by the reputation you have at the moment with the person you're talking to. Okay. In Middle Ages, social status was paramount. So the quality of your attire and how well-groomed you are, together with your reputation, can make a big difference. If you look dangerous, you... So that's influenced mainly by your string and the deterrent effect of your weapon and equipment. Other things are also taken into account, such as blood stains on your clothes. Seriously? You can sometimes rely on money. Yeah, I'm not gonna be like... I'm not gonna be like trying to bribe my father. <laughs> In special cases, you can try any of Henry's other skills. Uh, it is the horsemanship. Okay. Oh boy. Oh no. We're playing Final Fantasy XII, one is Samurai Uh I've actually never played Final Fantasy XII, uh, I stopped at 10 because 10 was bad enough. <laughs> you create your own character. Uh, well, they are trying to kind of push this like... It's like supposed to be a very story-based game, so... It makes no sense to make your own character. I mean, in Witcher, you also do not make Geralt your own character. You know, it's Geralt. Okay. Uh, strength, speed. Okay. Okay, I understand. Okay, so... Our charisma is really high for some reason. So let's try to charisma our, fa our father. Sorry, father. I was taking a stroll and lost track of time. Somehow I had a feeling I was seeing everything for the first time. How, my boy? We succeeded! Get some sense. Anyway, we've a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. Okay. I need some money, then. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh? That drunkard? <laughs> That'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arms. <laughs> sure I'll be happy to hear it. Is that all? The nodding oh, animation, right. though. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sassau. Okay. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Oh, they are blinking every now and then. You probably cannot see it because right. so make sure be I am streaming at 30 nice FPS. Cool Run along now. Work won't wait. See, normal human blinking is also not taking like, you know, fucking minutes. You know, in real life, you blink in a second. Okay. Converse, eloquence will help you with friends. Avoid trouble, and if you'd rather not beat around the bush, violence can also be a solution. So there's like different ways how to deal with things. Okay. Okay, so we have, like, uh, the things on the compass. Can I pull out my map? Ooh! Oh my god, I love this map. This is a very traditional map. Holy shit. Holy shit, look at this. This is some beautiful... Holy shit, look at how big this world... Oh my... Oh my god, this world is insanely big. Like, look at this, this is us, you know, we are like this little dude here, and this is the size of the fucking world. Oh no. Is this like all of Bohemia in one game? No way. I've heard of the explosive vet. No, I've never heard of it. 
Have some sexy times with Bianca, no. Okay, so we are supposed to go over there. Yeah, we shall go. Rum, bitches. Holy shit, Henry can sprint. Here's guys. Uh, I presume I'm allowed to go here since I'm on uh, Aaron. Yannick and Yaroslav. You know what's really sad? I actually know people with those names. For someone, see, for Americans, that's normal in American games, but, you know, it's weird to actually see Czech names in, uh, you know, an English-speaking game. Anyway. Robbie, with you. I'm with you, Henry. Okay. How are you? Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzig, and the Chamberlain has the cross guarding. There was no horse armor DLC. In Sassau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. Okay. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. And did I ever botch anything? <laughs> Where shall I start? Ah, shut up and give me what I want, or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Dude, you do not get to use a sword. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. Okay, so we got the cross guard. Okay, now we need to go into the town. Or village, I should say. Hello. <laughs> Can I steal a horse? Can I steal a horse? No, I cannot steal a horse. Oh, it's raining, okay. You can find all information about the quest in the quest log. Or the indicator on the map as well. Okay. Whoa, I'm dipping to like 20 frames now. Gee. Are you here to buy? Indeed I am, or I'll have nothing to smelt the ore with. And the king won't get his silver. <laughs> Which king do you mean, Master Tobias? The one sitting in some godforsaken dungeon, or the one who holds the key to the dungeon? Okay. These are strange times. Strange and ill-omened. But since I serve our liege lord, Sir Radzik, I think you know the answer. <laughs> the what is with the nodding animation? <laughs> the nodding animation is so weird. Now its citizens bend their knees to Sigismund. Unfortunately, that's not... That is a real way, a weird way how to say Sigismund. Sigismund. story reaches its end. I only hope Sigismund doesn't get an appetite for our silver too. Oh, because you said that you guys have silver, he's gonna be coming here with an army. Just saying. Oh, he probably doesn't even need an army, just like a squad of soldiers. Actually, there's a keep. Yeah, you definitely need an army for that. Actually, now that I think about it, uh, the keep, is it on a tactical position? Give me a second. I know this has nothing to do with the game, but, you know, it's historical accuracy. Uh, it's kinda on a hill. I mean, it is kind of a hill, there's murder holes, uh, there's a lot of areas where you can shoot from, the gate has a moat, does it, does it have a moat, yeah it does, so they can like lift this, yeah and that is actually a very historical castle during this time in uh, Bohemia, yeah, yeah, I like this, I like this, That's a, that, that, that is nice, uh, there's a, like, Literally how it was made during the time. Hey, uh, Vadredan, thank you for the hosting, really appreciate it. I mean, Borderlands soundtrack was pretty fun, especially the Vadredan Exploitation Preserve. I like Borderlands, so Borderlands soundtrack. I actually bought it the second soundtrack. Nice mod in the Bailey Castle. <laughs> okay, so we need to get money. Top of the trader. Traitor! That's it. Thanks. Do drop by again. That's a tailor. Welcome. Hope I have the pleasure of your visit again soon. More cobbler skit. Tailor skit. 
Armorer's kit. Blacksmith's kit. Oh. What the hell are you doing? I'm sorry. Ooh, fabric. Okay, so this is a tailor. This is like a smith. Like, not a, like a, a tool smith, basically. And this is like... What are you? Are you like... Oh! Oh, it's like it's like a herbalist. Okay, 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 I see. Okay. Sorry, I'm just trying to immerse myself right now. It's hard to immerse myself at 20 FPS. <laughs> Hair. Kyoto, cabbage, honey. God have mercy. What will you do with it? Yeah, I like this meat, schnapps. Sit. I'm gonna sit with them. Also, I have to say the clothes are actually really like properly done as well. So, yeah, so far, historical accuracy is pretty chill. Good health to you, Henry. She knows me. My well, I live here, so. Wort, garlic, carrots. God be with you, Henry. Well, someone is so nice. Oh, uh, what kind of kids are calling the? That would be. <laughs> it wasn't hosting anyone, so why not host some chill RPG times? Again, super appreciated. Honored had a very nice soundtrack. I don't actually remember the soundtrack of Dishonored. Like, at all. Last kids over everyone. I'm pretty sure that will not work in this game, because this game is trying to be much more realistic than Skyrim. I'm sorry, it's just... Okay. Yeah, it, it feels like Witcher. It feels like I'm playing Witcher, except the optimization is like a million times worse. Because I can play Witcher on the highest settings and stream it, but definitely not this game. Definitely not this game. Oh, that's for, that's for birds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's, let's get to it. Let's get to the questing. What is this? Buy ale. Uh, he said he wanted it to be cold, so we definitely are gonna do that. Though. Bag of charcoal. Go to the sword fighting lesson. Okay, let's do the sword fighting lesson. I kind of want to know which one was that. It was B. Okay, let's go for the sword fighting lesson. No, I don't think so. Thanks. Vanya. Oh, it's, it's Vanya, okay. So you haven't changed your mind about learning the craft of warfaring? Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? No, oh, it was nothing. Except mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. <laughs> no mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. Oh no, he has the whole Disney princess oh, thing. Dangerous place, and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? Yeah, let's go. Yes. All right. Wait on the Wasn't ground, swords man. for the nobles? Spears? Yeah, exactly. Like, I actually mentioned that at the beginning of the stream that, you know, swords were not exactly a thing that peasants used. Hell. You would need, like, at least a year of training in military to be even allowed to use a sword. Wait, I can walk. Oh my god, is the walking speed exactly the same speed as his? What is this? This is not what Skyrim taught me. <laughs> okay, so so far I have to say the game feels really nice to play. Like the movement is pretty okay. The animations are, you know, except for the like the weird nodding animation. The animations are pretty okay. You know, it plays like Skyrim or even better, it plays kind of like a picture. It's definitely a game that you will want to, you know, Immerse yourself in. Not bushing around too much. Just enjoy it, you know, just play it. And just, you know, when you have like a lot of free time, I guess. 
Oh, this guy's gonna kick my ass. Just watch. Hello? So, can we get started? Yes, we Not can. Good. And since today's the last time we'll be seeing each other, you can show me everything I've taught you. So you have not taught me anything. I don't know how combat works in this game because I I was I was told the combat in this game is fucking mental. Let's start with the basics. Keep moving. Your life depends on it. Okay. All right, all right. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. Okay. You never repeat yourself. Okay. Okay. Okay, I understand this combat. It's basically for honor. Except it actually has weight. The point of the blade is the stabbing. Try it a few times. Okay. Stab. Okay. 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 It's kind of difficult. Try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. Okay. You can chain your strikes together. Start a new attack as soon as the previous ends. You can change the attack zones. Okay. Okay, I see. You can like do like combo attacks. Woo woo woo. Oh, okay. So this is kind of more like Dark Souls because you have like a, the stamina meter actually runs away. Okay, okay. Okay. All right. That's enough. I don't know about you, but I'm tired of thirsting. Remember though, train hard. No one becomes a master swordsman overnight. Yeah, that makes you have sense. To work and work. And the main thing is to use what you've learned in real combat. There's nothing better than experience, believe me. Okay, that was really enjoyable. I like the combat system in this game. The combat system is really awesome. It's kind of like... Okay, so the combat in this game feels kind of like... If you have ever played Mountain Blade... But you mix it with Dark Souls. Like, the weapons have weight. Like, when you actually, like, attack... You are stuck in an animation, but you can chain attack to, you know, put... You can basically... There's like a queue of attacks that you can put after each other. I guess... It feels good, but, uh, you know, I have not actually fought anyone right now, you know, I only did this guy. But yeah, so far it looks really cool. I remember this game. Also, sorry, I couldn't actually focus on the... I couldn't actually focus on, this, uh, on the chat, so, you know, sorry. Anyway. So we cannot get the ale and we cannot get the charcoal until we get the money. So let's get the money from Kunish. That we see, yes. Well, now. I was surprised myself. We'll be able to end him. We'll pummel the enemy. <laughs> so I, I, I really like that we were not using real swords. We were basically using like fake wooden swords because you know that makes sense. So Kunish. You are fairly large, not gonna lie. Wash yourself. Really? Hey, Kunesh. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? He didn't say it back. What a cunt! I'm gonna, I'm gonna I smash his head in. You are in for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Yeah, pay for the tools at least, man. That's what our father said. You know you owe father for a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If 
he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. Ooh, okay. Hmm. Yeah, devs must be paid. Actually, you can expect a visit from father. If that's the way you want it. I'll tell father you won't pay, and you can tell him what you told me. Hmm. I mean, that is basically what the, the, what the father told us to do. <clears throat> okay, so I'm gonna go to the father if he doesn't have, like, an idea about this. Day two of new glasses, don't abuse. Oh man, new glasses, that's like the worst thing. Absolutely understand. And him rightly was supposed to be a legit fighting to Unscrew your pommel. Okay, let's, let's go to the father. Cheers, father. Yeah, about the things. About time. Have you got everything I wanted? Yeah, he won't pay and threaten me. I went to see Kunish, but he wouldn't pay and then he threatened me. I might have known. I'll sort him out this evening. I've no time for him now. Hmm. Yeah, but I need the money. But without Kunish's money, I can't buy those other things you wanted. Here's coin for the charcoal and the ale. I'll get it back from that mongrel this evening. Ooh. Grosh. Oh, yeah, Grosh. Uh, we actually use Grosh at this point. Yeah, we use like uh, copper groshes and silver groshes. We are not actually even using gold ones, I'm pretty sure. Okay, so we got the money. That's actually pretty cool. So y y you can like pick a fight with him or you can just go to your father and be like, cheers, mate, you know. Okay, so we need to buy Jaco Berno's helper. Hey, man. Good health to you. Yeah, let's talk trade, man. Okay, so we definitely want to add that to the basket. We are supposed to buy ten of it. Accept. Okay. Five. Okay. Oh, I can haggle. Let's have a word about the price. I. I. <laughs> oh God. Okay. Haggling works both ways. Whether you want. To... Yeah. Okay. Original purchase price. Your mo okay, so your money, original purchase price, last of your current offer. Okay. There's a lot to learn in this game. You move in one direction. Because does not. Money, okay. Okay. Okay, so let's try to lower it to like. Four, five. What about this? Well, a little more, and we'll call it a deal. Okay, okay. What about four seven? Ah, uh, there is lock picking. There is a skill for that. Okay, what about four seven? Finally, a reasonable sum. Oh my god, I just haggled. That feels so cool. And I don't need to be a dragonborn, you know, I don't need to be like running around and being like, Usrota. Yay. Uh, let's go to.
Need to get to the pub. Usually there would be like a door. Oh wait. I'm retarded. This is actually like normal. Wait, what? It's not a serious thing. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts. Traitor. Now even the Pope. God be with you, Henry. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsche spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. Sounds like a German, yeah. <laughs> Who do I care about the Austrian? Oh, Austrian even. Okay. The devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Winston is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund and... don't and forget about Gutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. <laughs> yes, but... Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk oh, this guy is asshole. Things. This guy is a real asshole. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? I love how his name is Fritz, yeah. It's, 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 it's like a chick joke, sorry. Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge pile of manure. You know, the one right next to this freshly whitewashed house. Ooh. You think we should redecorate? Is this, this what we are gonna be doing? Well, are you gonna be throwing you shit? But doing some turds all day. What are you saying, Henry? But I was going to get ale for a father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzik's sword. Come on, throwing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So I, I'm pretty sure there is Czech boys acting. Are you with us? Am I going to get a choice in the matter? Am I going to get a choice? Am I going to be able to say no to, you know, literal shit throwing? You know what? Fuck this shit. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> well, father can wait a while. Fuck my father. My words we need to bad. throw shit. I knew you wouldn't miss out on all the fun. Let's go. Heck yeah, let's do this. Oh, this, this is, this is, this is, this is stupid. The Western Schism. What us say about the Western Oh, that's a lot of... Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh no, there is, there is a lot of, like, history here, it seems. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, they did care. They did care about history. That makes me happy. Oh no, what what are we about to do? What, what the hell are you doing? Well, I'm uh, just running to you though. This is the plan of attack with your friends. <laughs> Matthew, Fritz and Matthias. So are we doing this or not? Wait, we have to check that the coast is clear. Why? Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? 
Aye, it is. Henry, you gotta lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. I mean, yes, that makes sense. Okay, let's talk to his to the wife of the guy. You. <laughs> Hello, Deutsch's wife. I love how she doesn't even have a name. What do you want, lad? Your husband's making trouble. I just went by the tavern, and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right, and King Wenceslas is a drunkard. That sort of thing. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty! The fool! Next thing he'll start on about the popes! He might have mentioned the popes, too. Thank you for telling oh, me. Oh, no! I hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. Oh, no! This is beautiful so far. Okay, time, time to throw pool. Go and get revenge on Deutsch. Fuck the Deutsch. <laughs> Is this actually happening? <laughs> okay, you don't do this in Witcher. By the trebuchet for king and country. For king and country, my ass. This is all good, clean, fun. Clean fun as they are throwing shit. For Sigismund! Woohoo! <laughs> shit! You bastards! Oh shit! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> hey, Hans, can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's what the old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Horse Hans! I'll make those smiles off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy Deutscher? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? Is this actually Doctor, happening? I'll make you pay for that. No, I will make you pay for that. Are we actually gonna Oh my god, battle music. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. Okay, I'm real bad at this. Okay, okay, let's not get knocked out. Ooh. There's probably like a parry button or something that I just do not know. Fuck you. Fuck you. Wow, what did. How do you do that move? Yeah, we failed. Get a particle waypoint in a hurry. If... Wait, wait. Ooh. Yeah, your stamina depletes very quickly when when you get tired. So I was actually doing my best to actually like hit them and such. I don't know what I was doing wrong. Maybe it's just because my my character is not that strong because I put everything to speech. God save Henry. The most powerful of hand. Hand. What the hell? Oh, sorry, man.
Real life, your stamina should deplete when tired. Well, yeah, it's just... See, in a game, that makes less sense than you would think. Violent, amusing. Wow. Wait, where am I supposed to go? Okay. It just felt like I was running for ages. Well, we sorted that Deutsch out. <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? That old bastard didn't stand a chance. True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. Well, let him. Then I'll snitch on him. And anyway, what can they do to us for throwing a bit of dung? Good point. It's not as if anyone really likes the Deutsch. Hmm. Yeah, nice job on the Deutsch's place. Anyway. Nice job at the Deutsches. Never a dull moment with you lot. <laughs> <laughs> so that, that was that was kind of cool, you know. That whoa game, game, game. Whoa, the game literally just froze for a second there. Okay, now we need to go to the pub. Man, this is this is a really interesting experience. Like me having to uh, going into a punch out with people, fucking throwing shit at the house. And this is just the first hour of the game. Like this is some this is some real weird shit that we are doing in this game. So now we need to go into the Yeah, it was like an insane lag spike. Oh no, I don't want to steal that. No, I don't want to be a thief. If I want to be a thief, I will play fucking Skyrim. Here, enjoy it. I'm just having. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm just having a look see right now. Yeah, that's all of that is stealing. Ooh, that's some interesting lightning. Rob. Wow. I love how everything's connected. It makes so much sense. You cannot do this in Witcher. You cannot like go into a, like most of the houses, only to like specific houses. Hard lock pick. Okay. Hard lock pick. I wonder how you level up in this game. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, Bianca! Marvel. This is the guy. The crotch. No! I'm not okay with that. Do you change that? Oh shit, I'm trespassing. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. Okay, you actually trespass in this area, okay. God, my hearing is so wonky, I forgot this hangover thing. You might me to drink heavily again. I will do my best to remind you. Greetings, Hen God save, my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? Oh, oh, you do. Your beauty, of course. <laughs> oh, noble sir. I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And apart from my beauty, what else might your worship desire? 
Okay. Yeah, I'll just get a pitcher for father. I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Aye. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. Okay. Thanks. It's a me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Oh. Here you go. And this evening I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking fellow was asking after you. Manny. Mm -hmm. I suppose. He's a man who makes his coin rubbing on his wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? I don't know. He promised to teach me how to use a sword. Oh, okay. How useful would that be to you? Enough. You sound <laughs> just like... Father. I love how everybody's like, you cannot use a sword. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Your favorite, savor your schnapps. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. Loot. Loot. Savor your schnapps. This is from time to time an important. And when you sleep, if you want to save the game yourself, you will drink. Oh. Oh no. Oh no! You need to, guys. You need to use uh, you need to use items to save in this game. Oh boy! Oh boy! Items that you probably have to buy or somehow earn. Oh shit! That's hardcore. That's uh, more hardcore than fucking Survive and Fallout 4. So that starts happening when you get drunk at the age older than 21. Oh, okay, fine. Dude, I actually am trying to not like drink anymore. I'm actually trying to get over, you know, like drinking and such. I know I'm Slavic and, you know, not drinking, but, you know, I'm, I'm just doing my best. Okay, I talk to her again. You know what? No, we, we have a job to do. Let's go to our father. Hey, watch it. Whoa, sorry, dude. <gasps> oh, shit. He's actually angry. He's actually increasing my shit. Oh, no. Remember in Skyrim when you, like, run into people and doesn't do shit? Well, in this game it does. There is a life sensitivity for me to deaden my hearing. Wow. Wow, dude, you, you need to stop drinking, like, for legit. You seem to be, like, not handling that very well. Sure, before I am uh, gonna talk to him... Oh, are those hops? I think these are hops. Yeah, I think these are hops. Wow, I'm rich. Yeah, let's watch, wash myself. Okay. Eat from pot. Drop into pot. Yeah, let's eat from it. You've eaten too much, you won't get hungry. You will be heavy handed and clumsy until you digest everything. Really? Really? If you eat too much, you get heavy handed and clumsy? What? What? What is this game? Oh shit, look, I'm actually. Yeah, this is like next to my health bar. You can actually see it. I am actually overfilled. Oh no. Oh no. Wait, that's stealing? Food. What the fuck are you smoking? Yeah, that's my food. You have the food coma. <laughs> Congrats, immersion. I mean, to be honest, it is immersive as fuck. Like, show me one other game where if you eat too much. Oh, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Feeling about versus alcohol, but 
wow, in my, in my chat right now, <laughs> there is a conversation between, you know, smoking pot and fucking alcohol. Uh, I love Twitch. I love Twitch so much. I mean, you said to eat a bit from the pot, you didn't say eat the entire pot. Yeah, it felt like my guy just, you know, just took the pot and was like, nom, nom, nom. Yeah, this is very historical. Like this. I'm just looking at the blacksmith area. Like, what would blacksmiths usually do is like horseshoes and like simple tools. Also, like, basically anything, really, that people would make. Okay, let's talk to father. Father! Yep, I have everything you wanted, Mom. About time. Have you got everything I wanted? Yep, yeah. let's start forging. I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good job. Let's have it then, son. Well done. Right. Let's see what kind of job the master and Sasal did for us. <laughs> Look at that lad. Ooh. That's what I call craftsmanship. What does the inscription mean? I'm damned if I know. Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Doesn't look like Czech to me. Lord Ordered, <laughs> this is such a weird thing to say. Oh, this will be the finest sword I've ever made. Have you got the charcoal? Good. Then fire up the forge. We'll put it all together. It's nice to see that our character actually knows how to, like, operate a, you know, a smithy. That makes me actually happy. By the way, someone paid me a call. Oh no. You might know what it was about. I'm not oh. sure. Oh no. Really? Oh no. Because I'm pretty sure you and your friends threw dung at Deutsch's freshly whitewashed. House. Oh no, consequences for our actions. And it was not a friendly visit. What got into you, Hal? That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund and the king. He got what he deserved. He got what he deserved, did he? You can go and clean up the mess you made and apologize to him. No. I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody, least of all the king. Do you understand? Yes. Look me in the eye, Henry. This reminds me of my father. Understand. I understand. I guess all the fathers are the same in, in this regard. And we'll never have this conversation again. So you think it's right to let traitors speak ill of our king? The boy gets caught making a fool of himself and he still hasn't learned his lesson. Well, of course I have not learned my lesson. I'm like 14 or 15. You turn into a common thug. You might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, try using your mouth and not your fists. That's what I've been doing this entire thing. God damn it, father, you judgmental freak. Right, we'll do the grip. Yes, that is actually considered that you are, like, a man. I'll heat it up, and when I take it out... You slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You know what you're doing. Yes, he's saying that we are supposed to bite, bite them. Oh my god, I like this. This is actually like... How a sword is made. Ouch, ouch, ouch. That has to be horribly, horribly burning. Good. Once more. That's it. Done. Now file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the garb. Man, whoever made these animations really loves making swords. Like, this is some insane detail. Father, why did you leave Prague? 
Who ever heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village? <laughs> I had my reasons, Hal. To be honest. You, why would I want any other life? You remember Emperor Charles? I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. He built half of Prague and a score of castles, had a bridge made over the Moldau and founded a university, and all without a war. He knew how to Yeah, that was actually our best king ever. Wenceslas, better by far. And Rudolf II was actually very good as well. Doesn't have it easy. He was actually an emperor in the Holy it's Roman em Empire. The shoes of someone whose life is born only once a thousand years. What about Sigismund? Do you think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. How's it going? Give it here, and we'll put it all together. But why do you think I keep saying things like moo? Why do you think moo is like my catchphrase? Oh god. Man, that is one hell of a sword. Holy shit. It is. The Lord be with you. My father sent me for those nails. Good day to you, Teresa. They're ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. I will. Henry, are you alright? <laughs> Wait, can you like... <gasps> you can... Oh, you can get over things. Holy shit. Man, I... This game keeps blowing my fucking mind. It literally says fucking... It says nails for Teresa. Also, Teresa is the name of, of my uh, sister. An old son. Yeah, I could never learn drawing. Wish I could, you know, like drawing. Like I wish I could do some, some something artistic. Like the closest thing to an artistic thing is like me streaming, which is not exactly artistic. Wait, let's talk to Teresa. Here you go. Here are those nails you wanted. Now I can nail you. So how's Bianca? Um, she's fine. Why do you ask? Just wondering. Will you be going to the dance this evening? We will. Maybe we'll see each other there. Anyway, mustn't keep you. I'll be on my way. That sword is truly beautiful. Oh no. She wants the D. Oh no. <laughs> Henry, you have a girlfriend. Come on, you ass. Fine lass, eh? Now stop staring at her and come and see this. It's time for the trial by fire. And by trial by fire, I mean we are gonna be cutting this twig. Okay. That's a pretty good sword. We did a fine job. I would expect nothing less from such a renowned. Oh family. shit! So that's gonna be Randri's. Hmm. You haven't lost your skill, friend. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Would you like to try it, sir? What good is a sword to a commoner? Try it. That was actually, that was actually awesome. Also, holy shit, Henry, you are shit at this. You even got training. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life, sir. Perhaps. But who knows what the future holds for each of us. I see that you almost have it finished. It just needs a polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Excellent. Fine work, very fine. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Isman? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. 
I don't oh, think so. How odd to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. A man of his talent would have no problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls and I must leave. I like how they do not look perfect. Like, I like that they... Like, everyone in this game looks kind of dirty a little. He is a master of his craft. I'm sure our pals will and they have like, you know, like, facial things, you know, that make them imperfect. Like, if you look at Mass Effect, and then you look at this, the difference is pretty stunning. In how more realistic, you know, the characters kind of look in this game. Because they were, you know, trying to be historically accurate. Have a safe journey to Stasis. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you. What side of the road do people in your country drive on? Uh, on the right side, obviously. It's like... Five countries on the planet where you drive on the left side. Your history. That was a long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Will you teach me how to use it like Sir Radzik said? No. Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green in the forge. Oh, you no Disney princess, you. Adventurous life, son. It can end before it gets started. I might teach you how to handle a sword, and then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. That is true. Shockers if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits. India as well, by the way. Keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in Scalitz, here, beneath the linden tree, and by your mother's side. If they die one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them or beat them. Meet. You have to keep going on about it. <laughs> then you've no need to learn swordplay. Hey, what? Okay, a messenger. A messenger? Oh, I literally just, just called it. What's happened? Oh, no. Oh, boy. Oh, that is bad. Oh no! Is my village and my entire family gonna get murdered? Is that Zygmunt? Yeah, that's Zygmunt. Yep. Oh boy. Oh boy! <laughs> we are so fucked. Listen to me, Harwood. Listen carefully. Take the sword, go into the house, and grab anything else important from the trunk. Go to the castle. Hurry, what about you? Oh god! Your mother is in the village. I'll fetch her, follow right behind. I'll go with you. No! You'll do what I say right now. Okay. Sort of Anything happens, we'll take care of you. Me. Oh, this this is bad. This is really bad. This is not okay. That is the worst gate ever. <laughs> Just stole some money. Ooh, that's kind of brutal. Okay. You don't expect gold in this game. I guess it's trying to be realistic and, you know, like, realistic medieval times were very gory. Oh no, Henry, you fool! Is this where we will get our actual, like, fighting tutorial? Then again, a commoner should not be able to kill a soldier. Oh 
Oh no, my father is gonna get killed by Zygmunt himself. That. Oh shit. Oh. Oh boy. Oh you, you can't. I am so gonna smash your head. Dude, Henry, Henry, you fucking idiot, just run. God damn it, this guy. I swear to God, this guy is like, holy shit. Guys, you have shields. The same. Okay. Okay. So, I'm just gonna presume I cannot take on a soldier. You know, someone with actual training and good armor and stuff. So, we should probably just fuck off. Like, we should just run. Run, Perlman. <laughs> yeah, let's just go. Meep! Meep! Meep, 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 meep. <laughs> Quest started. Run. Okay, I am running game. I am running so hard. I'm running, get a horse. I am running so hard. I don't even know whether there's someone behind me. I just do not want anything to do with that shit. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Go, 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 Henry, just run. Just run. Just, just fuck. Ooh. I was riding. WASD to trot the horse basic pace. Capsule you use recover. Okay. Okay. Fastest gain, but will deplete the horse's stamina. Smarter than your horse is smarter than some people and will stick to the power of your own What the fuck is that? Okay. Fuck, 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 get a horse. Yeah, there's soldiers over there. Yeah, get a horse. Uh. Yeah, yep. Yeah. You are a horse and I'm taking you. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay, ho horse controls. Meep. 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 Okay, okay, okay. We, we, we need to fuck off. We need to fuck off right now. What the fuck are you talking about? The guy's even talking about. Wait, are they talking like Hungarian? Wait, are these Hungarians? Also, we got shot. Oh. Oh shit, we are bleeding. Oh shit, we are bleeding. Oh my god, horsey, go, horsey. Whoa, 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 the FPS dropping. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. I can hear the arrows. I, I don't know whether you can hear it because, you know, my audio setup is not good, but I can actually. Okay, go left. Okay, holy shit, holy shit, holy shit. Warn the others. They tore it. Got it. I am scared of looking behind me. Run for it. Cause my character actually loses control if I'm not looking forward, holy shit. So slow down a little. Just run, just run, just run. I just presume there's like million soldiers behind me. Oh god. Oh god. 
Okay, this game has probably the best start I've ever seen for, for a game like this. Run, run you idiots. There's literally people with arrows who can shoot arrows from a horse, which I cannot do. I cannot even fight with a sword. And I'm bleeding horribly from my... I think I just run over him. God damn it. Okay, okay slow down. Speed up. Yep, yep, yep. Speed up. Speed up. Speed up. Speed up. Speed up. Meep. There's so many arrows flying behind me, by the way. Also, the screen is starting to look like a very, very bad pie. Yeah, that really sounds Hungarian. I like that they're actually keeping the fact that, you know, they are talking a different language. What games do that these days? Also, guys, what the fuck are you talking about in the chat? Seriously. Like, seriously, guys, please, 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 please limit that, that sort of talk. I'm not sure whether Twitch would be okay with that. Like, I'm not actually sure what Twitch's stand would be on that. Someone give him a drink. And bring hot wine and bandages. Hot wine? Why? Oh, because, uh, you know, pain. Tell me, boy. Who are you? And where are you from? What in hell's name happened? I've come from Scalitz. They burned it to the ground. Slaughtered everyone. Who? Who burned it to the ground? A huge army. They attacked without warning. And, and they weren't Czechs or Germans either. Who then? I don't know. I've never seen armor like it or heard their language. Maybe Tatars? Oh no. Tatars. Tatars, you say? Yeah. Well, we'll deal with that later. First, let's have a look at that leg of yours. Grit your teeth, boy. Oh no. I'm gonna pull that hair out. Oh no. No. That's not okay. I respect that. I'm just... Well, I just do not want to get you guys into trouble and myself into trouble. Like, I just do not know. You were lucky, lad. The arrow missed the bone. It only needed bandaging, and I've done that often enough before. War is a good teacher. Can you that stand? Is Holy shit. <gasps> Jesus. You Guys. Go. Good as new. Thank you. If you idlers nothing better to do, get back to work. You'll have to speak to Lord Divish. Can you manage? This is a survivor from I heard Robot. The fuck is MH? Tell me, boy, what exactly happened? Did you see the ensigns of the attackers? And were there any more survivors? So, um, I don't know what army it was, but it was huge. There were dozens of banners flying on the hill above Scalitz. The ones who did the slaughtering spoke a, a, a strange language. They burned Scalitz to the ground. But a lot of people took refuge in the castle. I wasn't quick enough. And as I fled, they shouted from the battlements that I should come and warn you. 
The soldiers the boy didn't recognize. They could be those Cumans of Sigismund's. It said they came to Hungary from the east, and now they're the core of his army. Okay. Attacking Gutenberg. Must have given him a taste for stolen silver. Skalos is a small castle. Oh, Monster Hunter, okay. Sigismund attacks. They can't hold. Okay, okay. Sir Robard. And our small garrison would be no help. Even if we could risk sending them. Do you think we're next in line? Maybe. Remember, in Monster Hunter, graphics do no matter. Only the gameplay. Henry, son of the Scalitz blacksmith. I know him. Did he make it inside the castle? I'm sorry. It's in God's hands now. No one else can help us. Anyway. Thank you for risking your neck to warn us. Robard, take care of Henry. Make sure he gets something to eat and some rest. Yes, sir. And get all the people inside the gates. We have to prepare for the worst. Make all the necessary arrangements. As you command, sir. I have to say, so far, I really like, really like the story. The story is really well done, and generally, it feels really good. Game so you did. These are the first. This could develop uh, the bodies constantly by using them. Every few level ups work to allow him to go to in a given skill. Oh. Okay. Healing potions. You'll take care of it, you understand? Thank you. Okay. Give me a second, guys. I actually got a call. I will be back in a moment. Sorry, people are people are normal here and call at eight PM, so I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. Sorry. Okay, so what do we have to do right now? Oh, probably sleep. In a private area. Okay. So where can I sleep? The lockpick area. 
No, seriously, where do I... I'm confused. Here's a way of cushion. Food. Okay, this is bad. I have no idea how to get more food. Yeah, let's talk to him. You've done well, lad. I'm sorry for your loss. You must be all done in. Why don't you go to the kitchen and have a good meal? Sorrow is easier to bear on a full stomach. That's true. Oh, God I damn it, my stomach hurts. I can't understand why he'd waste his talents, but I'm sure he had his reasons. He had a fine reputation. It's a great loss. Okay. Sir Divish has suffered his own share of woes, but he's a generous man and a good one. We'll take care of you until everything blows over. You risked your life to warn us, and we won't forget it. Okay, so... Yeah, okay. Ah, milady. You are fortunate our good lady Stephanie of Tomberg has graced us with her presence. My lady, I'm honored. So this is our brave young man? Welcome, lad. Bojana here will take care of you. I push you know. Doubt you're tired and hungry. <laughs> Indeed. How could he not? Be it's such an old name, I've even in Czech, in, even in He's my country. As a bear, aren't you, young master? Here you are, then. Eat your fill, and a little wine to wash it down. Thank you, my lady. <clears throat> when you're done, you can go and rest with the grooms in the outer bailey. No, that won't do, Sir Robard. After all he's been through, he deserves a proper bed. Let him sleep in a lodge in the courtyard. Certainly, my lady. Young Henry here is overwhelmed by your generosity. Oh, yes, yes, thank you, my lady. May God reward you for your kindness. Eat up now. You're in capable hands, so I'll leave you to it. Good night. Good night. Good night, ma'am. Yeah, like when Mo Monster Hunter World comes out on PC, I'm definitely getting it. When you've done, you can sleep in the bedchamber of the courtyard lodge. And don't forget to take off those filthy boots before getting into bed. <clears throat> okay. Objective of started, eat. The lento mesh. Whoa. Whoa, dude. Yeah, let's eat that, like, now. <laughs> okay, dude. Dude. Dude, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. We can, we can get you food. Don't worry, man. A bread roll. My fighting game title. Wait, in which fighting game can you button mash and you'll get ridiculously kicked your ass in? Dude, in Skullgirls you cannot button mash. Most of the characters actually need to use combos to even do anything. I own Skullgirls. Skullgirls is actually awesome. That there is food. Oh, that's wine. Oh, cheers. Okay, we need to eat. Like, let's eat a duck. Let's duck and eat. Yeah, nourishment is 93. That is all we need. Um, Be a bit more careful. Oh, woman, look uh, where you're going. Woman, please oh, God. leave the door. Uh, woman, I need to lie down before I split my face I'm open. Sorry about what happened to you, but it's no excuse for rudeness. Uh, woman, please fuck off. She's blocking me from moving. Um. 
Ähm. Wow. Okay, that was weird. <lacht> oh no. Not that way. Yeah, we can go over here. Not hard. Since we're also. Wow, my character is actually like, drowsing and shit. Oh no. Okay. Sleep, man. Just sleep. Okay. Let's have like a normal sleep, like. Like an eight hour sleep. Let's have a nine hour sleep. That seems about normal. Oh, I just realized. It looks like, uh, like, like Orloy. Oh, I get it. Nice touch. Yes. It is I, Henry. <gasps> Forgive the intrusion. I didn't wake you, boy. Did I? My the lady. fuck? Um. No, no, not at all. But what brings you here at this hour? A lady literally walks into my room. Could do with a little wine. Why are you giving me so much wine? shouldn't you could have sent a servant i was going to but to tell you the truth i couldn't sleep either i thought of you while saying my prayers how awful it must have been for you i came to offer you oh my god there's like warning signs everywhere run henry run she's gonna get you into trouble Oh yeah, this is this is a problem. Nope. No. <laughs> but I want you to feel at home here. You're not to worry about anything. <laughs> oh no. You've been through a terrible ordeal. I know what it is to be left alone in the world. Although your loss is much greater. But with God's help, the pain will ease in time. I mean, you do realize people actually turn in bed, and right? It can help to talk about it. If you feel like it. Game. Game. Okay. Yeah, though the story of the raid might as well. You might be right, my lady. I'll tell you what happened. It was terrible and unexpected. The day started just like any other. Father sent me into town on some errands. Oh shit. Yeah, I went to collect your debt. A fellow by the name of Kunish owed money to father, who sent me to collect it from him. Only Kunish had no intention of paying. It got a bit heated, as often happens when there's... Oh shit, it is like, limited time on some responses. Shit. Father was too generous for his own good. I can no longer play this game with one hand. Oh. When I'd done all the errands, I headed back home. I promised father I'd help him with his work, and I was looking forward to it. He was forging a sword for Sir Radzi. Okay. Yeah, Sir Radzi came to look at the sword. The sword was taking shape when Sir Radzik himself came to have a look at it. He praised Father's work and said that with his smithing skills, he could easily make a living in Prague or Vienna. You don't say. But Sigismund's horde was already on the horizon, ready to attack the town. Yeah, I saw the smoke on the horizon. 
I saw smoke on the horizon from a village Sigismund pillaged on the way to our town, which was soon to meet the same fate. God have mercy. And then death descended on Scalitz. Oh God. Scalitz uh, folk fled to the castle for cover. The gate to the castle was open. The bells and horns sounded the alarm and the villagers ran to the castle to take cover. They were carrying the few possessions they could grab in haste and I saw the terror in their eyes. I can't even imagine how awful it must have been. Oh, this is really, really scary. Like, I'm worried that if I fuck up, they will throw me away into that army. To save myself. The men on the battlements called down to me to flee to Townburg and warn you. I was lucky I knew a concealed path around the castle. Okay. Yeah, I needed a horse. I needed a horse to get to the safety of Townburg and to warn you all. And with all that was happening, you thought of others like a good Christian. Oh no, she's a Christian. A scream. It was Teresa, the mill wench. She'd been caught by a gang of Cuman savages who planned to violate her. Yeah, let's lie. I had Sir Radzik's sword, and even though there were several of them, and they were better armed, I had to try and save her. I wanted there to be at least one person I'd help, and I succeeded, even though it almost cost me my life. After that, I stole a horse from the- Did it work? Yeah. Fuck! How did that not work? I had good enough thing. It will haunt me for the rest of my life. It's terrible. How could something like that happen? God alone knows why he lets such things happen. You poor boy. I understand your grief, but God is not to blame for the ills of this world. That is the work of Satan and those who do his bidding. Those who are corrupted by greed, envy, and pride. You must not lose faith, whatever life brings. Fate has not been merciful to me and my husband either. Although in comparison to the horrors he went through. I was young when I married my husband. It was my father's wish. Divish was a lot older than I, but a woman must bear her lot. Shortly after our marriage, before I even got a look at Townburg, the castle was stormed and my husband was imprisoned. Okay. Really? My husband had some quarrel with Sir Havel Medek of Valdek, who decided Medical. to resolve it by force. Okay. He stormed the castle, burned down the village of Pribislovitz, and killed oh, all of our men. Even That's actually really close where I live. He imprisoned my husband in the castle and put his own garrison there. That's awful. I was barely 18 years old and all of a sudden I was left alone with Sir Robert. Robert. We didn't know what to do. We went to Prague to appeal to the king and sought help from Divish's friends, but... All to no avail. We tried for years, but it seemed I was destined to be left alone and my husband to rot in jail in his own castle. Look, I'm sorry I'm not talking much, but this is some. Seven years. Yeah, this is some hardcore That's how long shit. It took before Havel was condemned as an enemy of the crown, and even then he refused to surrender the castle and release my husband. In the end, I raised the money to pay a ransom, and only then, by the grace of Lord Jesus, did I finally lay eyes on my husband once more. Seven years. And was Harville punished for it? Never. And oh, after shit. seven years, my husband returned to me an infirm old man. So Divish seems like a good, strong man. Certainly. Only... He has many concerns. He had to rebuild Townburg. After he was released, the king appointed him Burgrave of Prague Castle, and he was very busy. He had no time for me at all. But at least we were in the city, and there was something going on. And now, 
We're here. This country is abrasive. My lady, you're still young. And... Well, there was basically this uh, big fighting over basic traditional way of living and western way of living Could it be true? the the western way of living was with christianity and such you have troubles also you know get rid of czech and we would only have german here and, let you sleep. and you know the traditionalists uh, they wanted to you know keep czech talk, Henry. Good night. they wanted to keep czech and our Good night. Good night. old gods basically you know like our traditional gods Uh, I can actually say the per Persona Arena is really good, from my own experience. Oh shit! Oh shit, we are having like a weird dream. It's a fever dream! Wow. No. Well, we were not a coward, more like we didn't want to go into like fucking 20 soldiers with plate armor. You don't want to miss this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on? What's happening? Come to the battlements. One of our patrols reported a company heading here from Scallops. Oh, shit. Are we gonna be defending a castle? We are only two hours in, and we are already gonna be defending a castle? No way. No way. Oh shit, it's night. Oh, that's gonna be... That's gonna be, that's gonna be difficult. That way. Wait, how do I get in? Wait, but uh, battlements, that means this. Also, holy. Watch where you're going. I'm sorry, me lady. Ah, Lord Almighty. I cannot actually move because this woman is taking. Look where you're going. Okay, let's go. You're in a private area. I mean, I'm supposed to go here? Yeah, I think I'm supposed to go here. Wait, what? I'm confused. You, what is it? Well, I'm supposed to go to Butlerman's. Why is it so dark? <laughs> Oh, I am retarded. I've been to these castles. Yes. True enough. True enough. I love how they don't have names, they're just guards. Then again, you cannot put like names for every single NPC. If it's Sigismund and his army, prepare for the worst. But don't be daunted by their numbers. Heed my commands, and all will end well. Hey, Robert. Oh boy. Yeah, what's going on? What's going on? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. 
Why would Sigismund advance on Talmurg in the night? Especially since he's lost the element of surprise after the raid on Scalitz. Maybe it's not him. Then who is it? The scouts Givish sent to Scarlet's to spy on Sigismund, said he'd set up camp and was getting ready to storm the castle. And Sir Radzig is an experienced soldier. He'd surely hold the castle for quite some time. It doesn't make sense. Oh, what else did the spies see? Not much of anything. Before they could get close enough, this huge storm started. And you were right. Sigismund has a hell of a lot of soldiers, including all manner of mercenaries. An army like that costs a fortune. Well, anyway... We'll find out when they get here, won't we? Aye, we will. Yeah, this is some... This is not okay. This is a really bad situation. Oh boy. Oh, Jesus. Oh! Who goes there? Lucifer and all his minions! Who else, Rubber? Sir Radzik! What a relief. Ooh, it's Radzik. there with you? Yes, sir. He is right here. What are you doing up so late, Divish? At your age, you need a good night's sleep. <laughs> well, Radzik, you didn't exactly pick the best time for an outing either. In a big hurry? It was a bit of a scramble, all right. Believe it or not, this tempest is a godsend for me and my men. As my old granddad used to say, better a sore throat than a slit throat. <laughs> I'd say your grandfather was a wise man. Your messenger told us what happened. Messenger? The lad you sent to warn us. He's alive? He made it to you? He's here with me. He only got away by the skin of his teeth, though. Thank God. A brave young man. But tell me, friend, how on earth did you manage to get away? Thank God for this tempest. When it began, Sigismund's Tatars crawled into their holes and left a storm in the castle for more... So they are Tatars, okay. We were able to sneak out right under their noses. The Lord be praised. We wouldn't have stood a chance against them. Would you like to spend the night in Tumber? No, no. When Sigismund finds the castle empty tomorrow, he might come looking for us. We'd only be exposing you to danger. Without me and my men, he has no call to attack you. Well, what will you do then? We'll march to Ratai. It's only a short a ride. Ratai. There we'll have a better chance of defense and enough room for all of these people. If Sigismund should come, better bend your knee, Divish. There's no point dying in a battle that's futile. You're right there. Get out of here, Stalker. I'm not even streaming Stalker, and people are making Stalker memes. Here, sir. You have courage, lad. That I can't deny. I am sorry about what happened. Would you care to join us? I'd like to, sir, but first I have to return to Skalitz. Are you mad? What do you want there? I can't leave my mother and father. I won't leave their corpses rotting in the streets. I'll join you once I've taken care of them. Don't even think of going back there, you donkey. Are you tired of living? No, sir! Quiet! I'm sorry about your father, but getting killed as well won't help him. Divish? I actually like that he had his priorities to bury his parents. That is actually a wonderful... Not to worry, you kind of see that he may be lazy, but he is not an asshole. I'll lock him up here as if he were Havel of Baldic. <laughs> I see you've grown a thick skin since your tribulation, sir. But thank you. We'll meet again when circumstances are more favorable. Farewell. Farewell, friend. <laughs> and good fortune. Give my regards to Sir hey, Ivan. I and you hope peace to like me. You will never shoot. Shoot the inaccurate for the fear time. of shooting fingers. Also, traveling in this uh, in this storm is probably very dangerous during this time. Battle of Nicopolis. Men, tonight we'll have triple patrol. Sort out the watches between you as always. Okay. If I catch anyone boozing, playing dice, or slacking off, I'll personally break every bone in his body. Ouch. I want you to keep a close eye on everything nearby. Sigismund will surely have sent spies, and likely men as well, to follow the Scalitz people, now he knows they've fled. Keep your eyes peeled, and report everything to me at once. Understood? I love how the torches actually, you know, like, actually do the, pro the, the light properly. Okay, let's talk to Robert. 
Robert. So can I be of help? What is it you need? I could use an extra pair of eyes, and yours are keen. Will you keep watch of the battlements with my men? Is that a request or an order? I'd rather it was a request you answered yes to. Of course I'll help. I have to pay you back somehow after all you He's such a sarcastic asshole. And don't worry. I'll tell the men to relieve you later. Okay. Keep watch on the battlements. Um... Really? Wait. Am I seriously supposed to just... Am I seriously supposed to just keep watch? My respects to you. So what do you think about the Skelet's folk fleeing? What do you think about how the Skelet's folk managed to flee the siege? Thank the Lord. I thought it was Sigismund descending on us. It seems everyone thought that. Well, we were all expecting the worst. And the truth is, I'm still worried what will happen when Sigismund comes here. And come he will, of that I'm sure. I just hope we'll be as fortunate when we're face to face with that fucker. By the way, Henry, my condolences. Thank you. I'm already making Wandering friends. Around like a stray sheep. Must be your first watch, eh? I don't think anything much will be happening today. You can just lean against the wall and wait till morning. I'll show you what's what. I will. Thank wait, you. really? If you have to wait for something, give it a best tea and said how long you want to wait. Watch out though, tiredness and hunger grow even during... Okay, so it's like Skyrim except, you know, actual consequences. Okay. Yeah, let's wait. I really like this. This is a... So far it's a very realistic, very fun game. I don't understand why people put like negative reviews and such on this game. Like, I don't, I don't see any like big problems with this game except, you know, the optimization. I'm actually dumb. No, Shershock, you are not dumb. You're not a dumb dumb. I mean, that's morning, right? But it was still worth go to my car. Why did you go to your car, sir? Hey lady. Yeah, there's like guards down there as well. But yeah, like so far, you know, two hours in, I'm really enjoying this game. This is a really good game so far. Yeah, I, I guess we need to wait one more hour. Shit. 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 What? What the hell are you doing? Oh, you doing? Oh, private area. Okay, can I go there? Whoa. Sometimes this game really like freezes and shit. Oh, there's a platform of, like Celeste. See, I have yet to play a modern platformer that, you know, is good. Go, go. Let's go, let's go! Move it! Quick! Working on it, dude. Oh no, is this gonna be another, you know, shit tons of soldiers? Oh god! 
scanners. Oh god. Sigismund of Luxembourg has a rare talent for winning people over to his cause. And by that you mean money and shit tons of soldiers. I don't think he will set his heathen dogs on us today. Greetings, Lord of Tomberg. Shit. That's the bastard who let the attack of Scarlet and kill my parents. Don't be an idiot. You don't want to end up like them. I am Sir Mark Bart von Aulitz. I come in the name of Sigismund of Luxembourg, King of Hungary and Croatia, who has resolved to strike against those who disrupt Concord in the land and to restore order in the name of his brother, King Wenceslaus IV. Restore order by burning and pillaging the king's estates. Greetings, Sir Mark Bart. The efforts of the king's brother to bring order to this chaotic land are undoubtedly noble. Oh God. It seems to me though, that he and his army have somewhat strayed. As Burgrave of Prague Castle, I am entirely beholden to the king. And here in Townburg, divine peace reigned until your arrival. To what then do we owe the honor of your visit? Yesterday his- Just look at the fucking army. ...against the enemy of the kingdom. The Ratzik Kobila, who has been using the silver from the Scarlet's mine to fund insurrection against the crown. Unfortunately, the insurgent escaped. Would you happen to know, noble sir, where he might be at this time? As far as I know, the Sir Radzik of which you speak is the king's hetman at Scarlet's. I find it hard to imagine that he would rebel against our king. Nevertheless, I can assure you that Sir Radzik is not a Talmurg. He would be a fool this... indeed to flee from one castle, where he has little chance of defense, to another, where he has even less. Or do you take the view that my humble manner is any obstacle to your army? I mean, it's not. To inform the king then that Sir Radzik Kobila is not a Talmurg, and that he has your loyalty. Sir Radzig Kobila is not here, and I have no intentions of getting embroiled in affairs from which I have nothing to gain. Very well, sir. As you wish. Oh shit, this will stand. Say your words to the king in the hope you will be as well disposed as you seem to be. Those who have clean consciences and goodwill may find themselves well disposed even at moments like this when there is little cause for joy farewell sir Auf Wiedersehen. oh he even said it in german oh it they really want me to hate this guy oh god they're gonna they're gonna like be like oh yeah yeah let's burn the place anyway Phew, finally one place that didn't did not get burned to the ground my lord you have my utmost admiration get on with you robot I wonder how many people literally shit their pants Okay, we need to build an army. Also, this guy, I will kill him. That guy needs to be killed. That guy didn't make speech at Dumpstead, that's for sure. <laughs> what is that, my, my fucking cleric? In D&D? Bury your loved ones in skeletons. Wait, what, what are we supposed to do? Loved ones in skeletons, talk to Sir Robert, get a horse. Okay. 
Oh shit. <laughs> Wait, what? Um, Robert? Robert, what are you doing? Um... Um... Are you okay, sir? Sir? Sir, are you having a problem? Um... Let's talk to him. My respects to you. Yeah, I have to get to Skullitz. The Robart, I need to get to Skullitz. What would you do there, lad? Sigismund might have left, but the place will be swamped with robber barons, brigands, deserters, and other vermin. And anyway, your lord commanded you to stay here. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I have to bury I have to bury my parents. My parents died there and I won't leave them to be ravaged by dogs. I have to bury them. Good God, boy. Do you want to throw your life away for those who can never get theirs back? Do you think that's what they'd want? Forget it. Okay. So why did uh, Zygmunt raid Skullitz? Why did Sigismund burn down Skullitz and then come here too? That's war for you, lad. Certain lords have resolved to take things into their own hands and eliminate anyone who doesn't share their view. Unfortunately, Sir Radzig is one of those. And what's more, he was sitting on a pile of silver that could help King Wenceslas' allies. Hmm. So what is Zygmunt after? Well, domination. Gutenberg. Well, I'm just a simple soldier, but the good lord gave me ears. And I've heard some things from Sir Divish and from those who fled from Sigismund's pillaging. Were there many? Indeed. But it was the Kutenberg mercenaries who came to see me, because I knew them from before. I see. Listen, lad. These are all games of the high aristocracy. In Prague, a cabal of nobles rebelled against King Wenceslas, wealthy aristocrats who took against our king for reasons of their own. There's no doubt Sigismund had his fingers in the whole affair. Him and Wenceslas's cousin, Jobs. And that cabal helped him abduct the king. So then why did Sigismund attack Kuttenberg? Why do you think? Hmm. Yeah, he was, he was afraid of the Kuttenberg insurgent lords. Because the lords there could have risen against him with their armies and stopped his conquest of the Bohemian territories? That's part of it. King Charles, may God grant him eternal glory, built Prague into a proper royal city, while King Wenceslas took a liking to Kutenberg. After Prague, it's the most important city in Bohemia, in the entire Holy Roman Empire. He who commands the Kutenberg silver is king. So Kutenberg sided with Wenceslas because he favored it. Now you're starting to understand. When Sigismund imprisoned okay. Wenceslas and took control of Prague, the people of Kutenberg began to raise an army against him. So with the attack on Kutenberg, Sigismund killed two birds with one stone. He defeated Wenceslas' most powerful allies before they could stand against him and also gained immense wealth. Okay. So what do we know about the Cumans? Where did these Cumans come from anyway? I don't know much about them, only what the Chamberlain said. That they came to Hungary from the east and settled there. They're godless barbarians. And so they are Hungarians. The nobles used to say the Hungarian king shouldn't enlist them because they dishonor our rules of warfare. But when there's power and money to be had, it seems that honor isn't worth my spit. And believe me, it's always about power and money. Yes. Yeah, let's end the dialogue. Jobs of Moravia. Ooh. Yeah, so this is kind of becoming almost like a Game of Thrones kind of thing. There's like pol there's like political intrigue, you know. Okay. Wow. Wow, wow, wow! I actually went a long way. Holy shit! I only now realize just how how far we we rode. That was actually kind of scary. Okay. Hello, villager. God be with you. God be with you. 
Yeah, about Sigmund's army. What do you think about Sigismund withdrawing? He was a stroke of good luck. I know everyone says how clever Sir Divish is and all that, but it was a dangerous situation. That Sigismund is awful unpredictable. He abducts the king, raids towns, brings foreign mercenaries into the heart of our country. God alone knows what he'll get up to next. Is there a traitor here somewhere? Can you tell me who I can buy something from or sell to? You want Votem, the fellow that fixes the weir at the Tamburg fish pond. He should be around the granary somewhere. Okay. Also be leveled by talking with people. What? Ah, oh, whatever. Hey. God be with you. Let's trade. Can we trade? If you've got the coin. Okay, so he is... What can I sell? I can sell my shirt. Hmm. Badredent, that's loot. Okay, so he is selling what big treasure map? Okay, oh, that's really expensive though. Uh, where do I see how much money I have? I have two. I have two money. I have two groceries. Cheap wine, dried meat. Oh, everything is so expensive. What about this? Go to boil. Days to boil the with meat or porridge. Okay, so we can't really buy anything because we literally don't have money. So what I'm gonna do is like I'm gonna walk forward and I'm gonna area out. Somebody you ring. Noticed how all the prices have gone up? Don't they always? Indeed. I was talking to some merchant from Prague about it, and he said it's like that all over. Why's that then? Well, the roads ain't safe. So they have to hire armed escorts. Them fellows don't come cheap. On account of brigands, like? Aye, they're all over. That damn Sigismund and his bloody heathens. In King Charles' day, we had peace and calm everywhere. Those days are gone. God preserve us. That's impossible. And that's not all. They say they can take a man down with an arrow ten fields away. And a dozen men is no match for one of them heathens. One of the soldiers was possible. Eat from the. T uh, do I have nourishment? You know, uh, I have good enough nourishment. No need to. Anything. Don't worry, we're safe. Safe? Sigismund and his heathen top soldiers. I swear to God. Are you serious? Exactly what I wow, sorry, man. I love their reactions when you like walk up to them and you know you poke them a little. Villager, villager. Whoa, game. Whoa. The game was like, no, eat the whole pot. No, I'm not gonna be eating the whole pot again. I cannot really do anything over there. Yeah, we should. Yeah, we should leave the castle. Oh, you know. Whatever you would call this. Let's talk to the guard. Maybe he will let me out. Let me out. Let me out. This is not a game. God be with you. Yeah, I need to get out of here. Need to get out of here. Whoa, what's with his face? And I need a feather bed with a comely wench in it. But it looks like we'll both be disappointed. Sir Divish gave orders not to open the gate, and you especially are not to be let out. Hmm. Yeah, I have to bur bury my parents. My mother and father were left in scallops like carrion. It's with the face. I can't leave them to the dogs. I'm sorry, my friend, but I can't. You'll have to persuade Sir Robard, or think something up so I don't end up in a shit for it. Otherwise, forget it. So what do you have on mind? What am I supposed to think up? How should I know? Maybe some disguise so I could say I didn't recognize you? If a Townberg soldier turns up all kitted out properly, 
in armor and a helmet, then of course I let him go. Okay. All right. I'll have a look around for something. Hmm. Okay, so we need to get uh, armor. Yeah, that changes a few things. Hello there, soldier. God be with you. Yeah, no need to talk to him. Oh boy. You know what? Before we do this, maybe we should just... Is this what your country would be like in the olden times? Yeah, so far it's really good. So far it's like a really good representation. Oh, you know, I could just jump down, really. I could just jump down and run away like a bitch. But no, I want to do this in, in a legit way. What are, what are you? Good day to you. What do you need? Okay, I, I think I just leveled. Skills. Drinking horseman. Speech. Okay, how do I... Okay. The final offer. Patience with get one more chance. The highborn. Okay, increases their speech level with by three nobles, healthy people. You don't have a lowborn. Okay. Commoner. Hmm. You know, we are probably going to be talking to a lot of, like... Actually, probably both. Go checks. Ooh. Rubber-doer. Women. Pursue them more easily. You can avail... Ooh. Okay. Okay, I like this. Oh, okay, guys. Since you know this is kind of a stream, what, what should I pick? A highborn or lowborn? I cannot pick both. Literally, if you pick one, you cannot pick the other. Ooh, first aid and sorry, aesthetic. Manly odor. What the fuck? When dirty, you have 50% more charisma when talking to women. However, people will smell you a mile off, reducing your stealth skill by 30%. <laughs> Dragonborn. No, this is not Skyrim. Ooh. All, all of these are like, you know, you have some something better, but something worse. Side distance of fast travel. Chances of evading by... Impoverished conditions of worse the bad, the better you sleep, and vice versa. Twenty percent worse. <laughs> so the game won me over with manly odor. <laughs> uh, lowborn. Yeah, let's take lowborn. We are gonna be a person of people. They are lowborn. Okay. Now, I have nothing in combat for obvious reasons. <laughs> I love this. It's such a stupid thing. Uh.
Probably gonna take this because it will not hurt me in any way. So yeah, let's learn that. He eats a lot of pots, so maybe highborn. Too late. <laughs> I'm probably gonna take a scout. It seems like it just helps. It will not like fuck me over in any way. Horsemanship. Horse. Okay, let's talk to you again. Hello, Robert. Oh, I cannot actually talk to him anymore to leave. Oh, shite. Man, the other woman, like that grease and grime. <laughs> oh, that's a shit pile, yeah. I'm sorry, mate. Drop into the pot. Good day to you. Rimey Lou King. Yeah, I cannot actually... So if, like, just talking to people actually increases your stuff... Oh, you, you cannot pick up from images. Ah, that is so realistic, I like it. You would not be able to do that in real life, like, because, you know, like, you don't, you have better shit to do than to just pick up fucking cabbages. Ah, I love it. I love it so much. Hello there, guard. Jesus Christ, be praised. Wow. Jesus Christ. Brokey. Come make sure no one sees you or hear Posture and your clothing for the day. Wow, that is complicated. Am I supposed to be here? Okay, I think I'm supposed to be here. Okay, so I cannot get anything over there. I presume a lot of a lot of this is like trial and error in this game. Can I jump over? No. Nope. Man, if this game had vaulting, that would literally make this a ten out of ten experience. Whoa! Okay, jumping tires you out a lot. Chicken. Chicken, chicken. Shit, private area. Sorry. Honestly, did not realize. Guys, cutting wood. I'm not trying to find anything that would like uh, allow me to, you know, get out. Cabbage picking, man. Go back inside. Ooh, maybe talking to the lady would actually help. The lockpick. Oh, yeah, that's. Uh... Well, I'm sorry, sir. What happens when you die in this game? Well, you die, and if you don't, if you have not saved, then you lose progress. For obvious reasons. Dying seems to be a really big deal in this game. Villager. Oh, that is. Oh, that is actually so, like, realistic. Oh, I love this so much.
You can build a cabbage pot to launch yourself off. <laughs> no, that's not how that works. Okay, let's talk to the Lady Stephanie. God save. Can I help you with anything? Yeah, I have to get to Skullets. I would like to ask your assistance, my lady, if I may be so bold. What's the matter, lad? I need to get out of the castle, and your husband is keeping me here by force. Why, for the love of God, would you want to leave the castle? Okay. We should be able to just talk her out of it. So yeah, I have to bury my parents. My parents are lying in the mud of skullets at the mercy of dogs and jackdaws. I can't just leave them there. That's terrible. May the Lord have mercy on their souls. But how can I help you, Henry? I don't want your death on my conscience. If I could just get past the guard at the gate somehow. But... but you can. If you wear a proper suit of armor, and if he can't see your face, he won't recognize you and he'll let you go. Good thinking. Hmm. Yeah, where can I get armor? And where can I get the armor? At the armory? Where's that? In the gate tower. But the soldiers sleep in other places around the castle too, and you might find armor nearby. Okay. But if they ask me where I'm going? Well, they'll certainly ask where I'm going. You could tell them Sir Robard sent you to Ujit. To ask the parish priest how the folk there are faring. That sounds reasonable. Okay. I'm not gonna ask for a bribe because, you know... I must go now. Yeah, let's ask about Sigmund's army. It seems like talking to people really increases your speech. ...by the arrival of Sigismund's army this morning. Well, it was to be expected. And thanks to God's mercy and my good husband, there was no more bloodshed. But it's something else that distresses me. Maybe my mind deceives me. But I have an evil foreboding. You, my lady? Surely not. No evil could possibly come to you. I fear something bigger and worse will come. But Sigismund is only another omen of imminent evil. Of great evil. Evil! Okay, so we need to get an armor. Oh shit, private area. I'm gonna go there. Nope, 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 nope. That's a lockpick door. Hmm. We need to get an armor. Ooh, that's a hard lock pick. I mean, it kind of does make sense that you would be like, you know, trying to keep your shit secure. I'm basically just trying to find anything at this point. He's praying. The heck? I was actually praying to be to the, like godlike people. I don't even know whether what I'm doing is correct. Fucking nothing. You don't mean to send it. What do you mean? Okay. Oh, 
Fuck! You don't want to die. Shit. Yeah, fuck. That was not even my fault. Like, that wasn't even my fault. That was literally the game throwing me down the fucking ladder. What the hell? Shit. Wow, you really legit have to like bandage both. Fuck. Like, it was too long to send. Uh, I actually have no idea where to get, like, armor. Private area. Hard look big. Yeah, I think I'm stuck, guys. I actually have no idea. Because all of the chests are really locked. Yeah, like, all of the chests are locked. Why can't she just give me a piece of armor? I'm just trying to fucking bury my fucking parents. Am I really that evil? Yeah, even that has a lockpick on- Wow! Literally everything is locked. And again, you know, it makes perfect sense, but... Ugh... Art. Yeah, like she said, armory. But like, where the fuck is the armory? Who's there? Answer me. Sorry. Oh, I can take the torch. I use the torch by holding I. Nighthawk potion. What? Suddenly potions. I told you might have to break the law and escape a lockdown. Dinner. What I told what? Mountain steel. Yeah, like yeah, that's my, my that's my horse. Hmm. But let's talk to Cook. Yeah, but can I buy something? If I needed some food, who should I ask? Who do you think, young man? Me, of course. And if you want something extra, I could help you out with that too. Really now? Yeah, let's trade. I'd like to buy something from you. Of course, lad. Oh, but everything's so expensive on her. Oh no. Oh no. How do I make money? 
How do I make money? Okay, I can like pick up some food in here. Rob? Why would I rob anyone? Eat from the pot. Be a bit more careful. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. Oh my god. So I do not have lockpicks. I'm supposed to probably lockpick something. See ya, dudes. Oh, you are going. Oh. That noises. I am so confused. What am I supposed to do? I don't understand. Knockout. What? What? Yeah, have a have a good one, man. I'm so confused. <laughs> okay, whatever the fuck is this? It's like over there on the map. I was there. Probably some animal. What was that noise? I don't understand. I don't understand. I have a button for whistling. What the fuck? Good health to you. Yeah, what do you think about the Skullets folk feeling? What do you think about the flight of the Skullets folk? I'd say Sir Rodzik is a fine lord. He made the most of the situation and saved his subjects. You don't see that very often. He was lucky that big storm came. But that's just it. Something happens by chance and you turn it to your advantage. There's not many capable of thinking so fast. Hmm. Hey, watch it. You literally walk into me. Dude, you walk into me. What the fuck are you complaining about? So yeah, this is a problem. I probably have to... S bribe someone. Well, I cannot bribe anyone because I literally don't have money. Let's talk to this guy again. Come on, Radim, don't be a fucking asshole. Come on, man, just let me in. Or more like, let me out. Yeah, I need to get out of here, man. I need to get out of here. You here again, boy? Didn't I tell you how much trouble I'd be in if I let you of all people out? God damn it. I am so, so fucked. Oh, wash yourself. I hear our scouts found a fresh pile of human bones that we had for harvest, and now we've armies invading and pillaging. I tell you, the judgment day is coming. Okay. No one is helping. No one is even close to answering my shit. Come on, Robert. 
Jesus Christ be praised. Your face. Okay, I actually have no idea anymore. Like, I, I have no clue. Good health to you. At this point, I'm trying to talk to ev everyone, but like, there is like no one, no NPC helping. Uh, not a thing. Fuck. It's like everything is private. Like, I, I legit have no idea. Oh my god. That's frustrating because it's like over there is the gate. This is like the hardest thing I've done in uh, like f 10 years of playing because the game doesn't tell you anything that you are supposed to do. I was. Can I take this out? And talking doesn't actually get you anywhere. Even when you succeed. It's all a lie. And double break my spine. No, it's not even about law abiding. There's absolutely nothing I can do to actually steal the armor because I need a lockpick for which I don't have money. Well, I cannot murder people because in this game you actually kind of like kill people. Like you can, but you will get killed immediately. Uh, push ourselves again. There's a guy. Well, yeah, she said that, but I have not found any armor anywhere. Like, I am so confused. Well, yes, I understand that it's in a pri private area, but the problem is that even when I get there, I don't have a lockpick in order to open the chest. Like, I actually know where the thing is now. Like, it's uh, up here. Or at least I think that's where it is, because, you know, the game is not exactly telling me. Like, it, it's, it's over here, I'm, I'm pretty sure. How it's not even there? Where the fuck is it? It's like in here. No, it's not even there. What the fuck? It's here. It's either over me or under me. I am... Dude, I just need to get over you right now. Oh, this is... Like, I am all for, like, unmarked quests and shit. Like, I really do not mind those. I actually kind of like them, but... This is really bad. Like, I actually have no fucking clue. It has to be in this building. This this looks like a important building. I cannot talk to this guy. 
Uh, I have no clue. Everything is locked. Everything is locked. Everything is locked. Everything is locked. Okay, I, I give up. I give up. I actually need to look this up, so give me a second. Okay, 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 give me a second. Kingdom come deliverance getting armor. What the fuck? Yeah, how how to get out of Dumberg? Please tell me. Oh, so you have to talk to her and get money from her. Okay. Seriously? Seriously. Seriously. There is absolutely no other way. You legit have to talk to her. Get money. God save. Can I help you with anything? Wait. What do you think, my lady? Do I look like a Townberg soldier? Not quite, Henry. Just look at you. Wait. I see. Well, thanks. My lady, I hope you weren't unduly distressed by the arrival of Sigismund's army this morning. Well, it was to be expected. And thanks to God's mercy and my skip husband, through it? there was no more bloodshed. Maybe my mind... Okay, I can actually escape, okay. Oh no, I can no longer get the money from her! <laughs> Dear Jesus, this is so bad. Okay, um, yeah, this is a very interesting problem. I don't I don't understand. Oh, this is really bad. Can we purchase it? Time to get creative sell him. Of arrows, like arrows will be marked as stolen. Okay, so there are barrels full of arrows which are not marked, which will not be marked as stolen. Okay, okay, guys, we are looking for barrels full of arrows. Which which might actually take us a while. Why is everything locked? N uh, Bianca got penetrated by a lot of arrows. I'm basically l currently stuck. Looking for barrels with arrows. How are my initials on them? Like, I like the animations, but they are too long. 
Okay, so. Okay, apply. Wait, what? How do you save? Okay, resume. Once of server snaps, you will be better again at up of Okay. We need to find. We need to find barrels with arrows. This is actually real bad, like, holy shit, this is actually much worse than I expected. Okay, so here are barrels. Are these the barrels with arrows? No. God fucking damn it. Okay, this is bad. Why would you do this? This is so stupid. Like, have you not learned anything from games that, you know, came in the past 30 years? Oh my god. This reminds me of Metal Gear Solid 3. One ladder in there. Which is like, really bad. Are we actually progressing, or are we, like, not progressing at all? Okay. <laughs> this is so bad, what the fuck? How was your Valentine's Day? One, we do not celebrate Valentine's Day, and two, uh, it's shitty, I guess. What am I supposed to do? What the fuck? I don't understand. What's... The fuck? Like nothing! Nothing tells me anything! What the fuck is with these guides? It's like ever it's like someone has made one guide and everyone has basically just copy pasted the same guide. What the fuck? Is that what happened? The fuck? Okay, so basically we missed our opportunity to get the money and because of that our playthrough is basically fucked. Oh! <laughs> oh boy, this is bad. This is really bad. And you cannot jump dead because, you know, y your character... One, you cannot go get over there. And two, your character is, is so spindly that you will literally explode if you try to do that. Let me out, let me out, this is not a game. <laughs> okay, how expensive is the fucking... Be with you. How expensive is the thing? If you've got the coin. Well, I don't have the coin because the game refuses to give me any. 
Oh my god, it's 18, 18. It's fucking 18. What? How dare you? How dare you, game? Oh my god, like... Oh no. The problem is I cannot sew any of this. I need the food. I need the bandages. Otherwise I will be fucking dead. He doesn't even have enough money. doesn't even have enough money. He actually cannot get enough money to buy the lockpick. <laughs> uh, the motherfucker has no money. Are you real? Give me a second. Give me a second. Okay, okay, okay. So... <clears throat> Kingdom come deliverance money cheat. Weeks also probably will go difficult. Mode. Okay. Oh, that doesn't actually help. But it, these are not cheats, what the fuck? Okay, so cheats do not function anymore. They work in the beta. Oh no, what am I supposed to do? I cannot get enough money, I cannot do anything. I'm actually stuck. I don't know. The thing is, like, I have nothing to sell him anyway. Wow. I am actually stuck. I, I, I legitimately cannot continue. I can't even jump over this. Come on, game. Fuck you guys, I'm going home. <laughs> it was so simple. Holy shit, it was so simple. It was so fucking simple. It just jumped off. Say what? Got you. What? Jesus, you gave me the runaround. What? Let me go for Christ's sake. I have to bury my parents. You're going nowhere. Except back inside. Oh for fuck's sake, seriously? I have to bury them now. If I don't bury them now, they'll be ripped to pieces by jackdaws and scattered over unhallowed ground. And I'm stuck here, a stone's throw away. 
All right, shove me. I'll pretend you got me off guard and I fell over. I'll deal with the others. You just get out of here on the double. Okay. It was so simple. Wait, is that actually a shitter? Oh my god, that's a shitter. The fuck just happened? <laughs> oh my god. What is this game? What is this game? I need to stop thinking about this game like in a normal RPG. This is obviously like... Like, why should I be, you know, going around trying to pick up a fucking piece of armor if I can just, you know, jump off and fuck off? Like, you don't need to do questing in this game. Okay, let's check out this area. Give that guy Oscar. The Huntsman. Okay. Nicholas. My respects to you. Who training? I'd like you to show me some hunting tricks. Certainly. Yeah, beginner. I'd like to practice the basics. All right, but it'll cost you. Oh no! <laughs> Maybe another time. Why is everything? Why is everything in this game so expensive? <laughs> so everything in this game is so fucking expensive. It hurts my soul. Oh, fuck. I mean, to be honest, it wasn't so expensive to get around, especially, like, you know, if this was richer, I would be able to just, you know, get a few jobs and here and there and, you know, just do a few things. See, I wanted to, I wanted to get money from her, but she would not talk to me anymore. Ooh, that's actually... It's actually pretty, that is literally... Again, it, it blows my mind how realistic this game is. It really blows my mind, just how... Like... Fishing spot. Can I fish? Oh, that's poo. Harry Smith, Mel Jiggle. Let me go. Let me go. This is not a game. <laughs> no, seriously, what the fuck? Lodgings. Marta. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Ale house maid. Remember you were telling me you looked the house over to see what needed fixing after the winter? I I've been to see the carpenter about when he could get out and keeper. Why is everything a private area in this game? What the fuck? What are you doing? You walk into me, what the fuck are you doing? 
It's gonna be a wine cellar or oh, meat cellar in this case. That is a chest that's not like. Oh my god. Wait, it has nothing in it. It has nothing in it. It has nothing in it. Of course, it's not locked. It's nothing in it. Why would you have a chest with nothing in it? Why would you have a chest with nothing? You don't have a lockpick. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, I need to get over, then over this bridge. Okay, I need to find two bridges. I mean, it, it, I, I, okay, okay, it's logical. I'm not complaining that it would be stupid or illogical. He's over there, so Damn it. Got you. Jesus, you gave me the run around. <laughs> Let me go for Christ's sake. I have to bury my parents. You're going nowhere. Except back inside. Oh no, it only works once. But I have to. All right, take me. God. That's a good lad. God damn it. Oh. <laughs> I am literally crying. This is not fair. I was outside. <laughs> I was outside. I was outside. I was outside. Good day to you. What do you need? I was outside. <laughs> Okay, I legitimately need the armor. Otherwise, I need to sneak the entire the entire time. I I don't think I can continue. I don't think I can do this. Like, this game is the most anti-user game I've ever played. Where the fuck are the barrels with fucking arrows? There's supposed to be barrels with arrows. The guy that has said. No, I need you to die. Both of the guys by the bridge, you dropped it over. <laughs> Why is the game freezing? Why are you freezing? <laughs> anger, anger, anger. So much fucking anger. There's no card here. <laughs> But the thing is, even if I jump, they will just get to me. Wow, very hard. Look. I don't know, guys. I don't know how to get out anymore. I legitimately have no idea how to get out anymore. And the game is freezing a lot. Oh my god, is this the legendary area with... <gasps> it's the barrels with arrows! Come on! Oh, come the fuck on. There's two barrels. I can definitely see two barrels. Build. The fuck! Fuck. 
Okay, go. Dude, I did that. I literally did the whole jump down the thing. Okay, whatever. I have some fucking arrows. Okay, fucking trade. If you've got the coin. I have s I don't have coin, I have fucking arrows, man. What? What? They're actually so much less now. <laughs> no. Oh, that's... How much do you want for the lockpick? 18? 18? <sighs> Jesus fuck. Would this be any worse? Would this actually be any worse? So the boost. No, I need the boost because you use this boost to to save and you use this boost to heal. No, you cannot sell the you cannot even pick up the shields. What the fuck are you talking about? Okay, haggle the shit out of this. Can we do something about the price? Naturally. Okay, let's haggle the price. Okay, let's just haggle it to like nine. All right, so okay, okay. So we got some money. We have like five times the money we started with, and that's still not enough. I don't even know where you can see the money. Oh, okay, here you can see. It. I have eleven point one money man i understand that you know this game was heavily inspired by oblivion i kind of wish they would go all the way though i kind of wish they would like go you know like running actually increases your agility and stuff like that you know that would be kind of cool that would be Wonderful. Because now, you know, the... Oh, fucking hell, this... Okay, I'm actually gonna say one thing. Check castles were not exactly good. You know, like, check castles, you know, except for, like, one or two. They immediately fell. They, they, they were really bad. And I can kind of understand why. If this is, like, actually historical castles, then I can understand why, because this is... This is some really shitty design. Again, this is nothing nothing bad for, you know, the developer. Oh, cool. Holy shit, you can actually take the shields. Go, 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 go. I mean, say whatever you want, but at least, you know, Ger German castles fucking held and, you know, would usually just be starved. Can we trade? If you've got the coin. I got the coin, boy. Okay. Okay, it's like no money, but it's okay. Need to buy the book pick. One lockpick, because for some reason lockpicks are the most expensive thing in the universe. Add all of these into the basket. Still not enough.
Okay. Take out. Remove the arrows. Are you serious? He actually doesn't have money. You know what? Yeah, just. Yeah, close the deal. Oh. Unity. Please stop. Not to mention, I definitely cannot buy another lockpick. I just don't have enough money. Oh my god! To get a save, you need to pay 121 gold? Are you actually serious? Are you fucking serious? This is actually... This is actually insane. That is actually insane. Holy Mother of Jesus. Okay, let's get one dry dry meat. Why? Dude, Jesus, this is like the most expensive motherfucker. Okay. No. Wait, what? What? Is that still... Get five. He doesn't have that, so... I guess one more dried meat? So I could get a couple cheap wines? Okay. I will try to haggle this. That's stolen. Fuck! On me. Get the hell out of here. Are you real? <laughs> Get the shields, you know? It's gonna work, maybe. What the fuck? No, I, I will not sell the sword. It's like the only thing. If you've got the coin. What the fuck is this game? So why would you even like? Okay, okay. I have one, like one question. Why would you steal things if you cannot sell them anyway? Okay. Why do look big? Get the shield. It's gonna work. Jesus! What are you trying on me? Get the hell out of here! Oh, okay, um... I honestly just cannot progress anymore. I actually legitimately cannot, cannot progress anymore. Like, this guy somehow magically knows that, you know, these shields I've stolen. I hated this. I hate this in every fucking game ever. Like, how do you fucking know? How do you know I have not bought these of someone, anyone? How the fuck do you know? How the fuck do you know? Bro, he's the only traitor, dude. Man, man, this game went to shit after the two hours. And again, you know, it's it's the refundable time, you know, you cannot refund the game after two hours. I wonder why they made the two hours really good and then the third hour really fucking bad. So that you cannot refund the game. Wow. I really did not expect this from fucking... This was the one game that could have given, like, my country a run for its money. Like, we could have, like, gotten back ourselves, we could have gotten ourselves back on the fucking map. You know, with gaming, especially now that Poland did that with Witcher. But no, they had to be like, oh, by the way, you cannot sell shit, you know? Because somehow he knows magically. And then the game freezes.
It's like game runs at like 50, 50 or 55 FPS and then suddenly freezes. No, the game will not get better because I will not progress. There is no way to progress because the game is shit. But the game is actually shit, like, like in no game I have played in my entire life would I get stuck in small area, not being able to progress in any way, shape or form because the game is too shit. Just jump- I DID THAT YOU- <laughs> Unity, please, stop the stream right fucking now, rewind it like an hour back, and just watch what happens if you jump off. Just do it. Just fucking do it. I don't even understand why I'm talking to you, you are just a fucking troll. Man. I can wash myself, like, a million times. Need to find a guard. The only other idea I have is to punch a guard, knock him out. And get his armor. That's literally the only other thing I can think of. And it's only because I didn't ask for money. And then you cannot come back and ask for money again. Because, you know, that, that is reserved for good games, I guess. Like, okay, I bitch about Fallout 4 a lot. You know, like, I bitch about Skyrim, about Fallout 4. But at least in fucking Skyrim, you can never get into this situation where you are literally stuck. I paid money for this game this is not like a free-to-play game you know where you know you get stuck and you know it's like oh yeah you got stuck but you didn't pay any money for it no this is a game this is a full full price game that i literally just got stuck on because the de developers do not understand how to make games like what the actual fuck were they smoking Add more arrows. The arrows are literally the only thing that doesn't count as fucking stealing for some reason. Wait, I'm back here? Okay, we have like all the arrows. In the world right now. Okay, so for some reason, arrows do not count as stealing. Wait, this is stealing. What? But those are not, but these are, you, what? 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 Like half of those arrows are stealing and the other half is not. What the actual fuck? At least be consistent, at least make them all stealing or not, what the fuck? Oh my god, I'm actually getting a headache. Like, this is this is bad. Like, this is probably the worst design I have ever seen in any game. Like, wow. L like, and then the game fucking freezes again. Ah! See, I really wanted to be nice to this game. I really wanted this game to be, you know, like, the one game, you know, that I would really care about, you know, making this. The thing is, I'm gonna get one lockpick. If I fuck up the lockpicking, the game has not actually explained the lockpicking in the game yet. Can we trade? If you've got the coin. Okay, we can sell the. No, those are his. 
Why would you stock me on buy if the only reason why I'm talking to this guy is to sell shit to him? Okay. Buy his lockpick. One lockpick for some reason. Fucking 18 gold. Okay. Sell these. We need to sell 18 arrows. For some fucking reason. Oh wait, the, the guy doesn't have enough gold. Why do we not have enough gold, you are? Okay. Now we will haggle the shit out of it. I'd like to discuss the price. Kai? Yet. Wait, am I lowering the price of the thing or... Wait, what? What am I doing? Like, I'm actually giving him money. Oh, am I not giving... I don't understand. This game has no idea what to do. Wait, what? I don't... What am I doing? Like, okay, okay, okay. You cannot do haggling if you put, like, your things and his things. That's not how haggling works. You cannot haggle with items. You have to haggle with money. But... I don't understand. What am I doing right now? Okay, okay, let's click help. Is it gonna actually explain? But who gets? Him or me? Like, what? I, uh, what? You know what, I'm just not gonna haggle. Uh, the haggling just doesn't work in this game at all. Wait, is the fucking whole thing to go? <laughs> what the fuck? I will never complain about Skyrim ever again in my entire life. I will never complain about Skyrim ever again in my entire life. Not once will I complain about Skyrim. If I ever complain about Skyrim, remind me of this game. And I will actually just punch myself or something because... Holy mother of Jesus, I have never seen so many mechanics on top of each other being so bad. Holy shit. Why would you kick me out of the fucking trade? Just because I did not decide to haggle, are you fucking real? If you've got the coin. Just, just, just shut up, shut up, nobody cares. Yeah, I am actually I am actually probably gonna go to Skyrim after this game because this game is absolute dog shit. And you have no idea how hard it is for me to say, considering that this is a game that was supposed to be so important for oh my god. Oh it's just, I guess you know if it's check it's just bad, you know. Okay, let's not haggle. Let's close the deal, don't even haggle. Okay, we have one lockpick. We have gained a lockpick. Now, we need to somehow find... We need to find a one single... There's so many chests. What is this? But I cannot save the game, I already use a save. Those, those things are expensive as fuck. I will not have money to do that anymore. That's hard. Where the fuck? Just with the armor is the wall where the shields were. Okay. So I need to somehow find my way there again. And no, I, I have no idea. How long are my legs gonna be fucking hurt? What is this fucking Arma? No, even in Arma it's not like this because Arma understands that, you know, there is a limit to real realistic. You basically just get the medic and, you know, your legs are not broken anymore because, you know, that's how it should be. It's a fucking game. I legit have no idea where the shields were. That's how bad this is. Like, everything looks the same. Legitimately, everything looks the same.
How many saves do I have? I have two more saves. I'm gonna save now. Oh, the god. So bad. What? Um. 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 Huh? Um. You must have at least one lock pick, blah, blah, blah. Get it by the size of the find it what what and the mechanism because the rotation shares the position of the sweet what um huh um um I'm pressing D. I am pressing D, what the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my god, what is this? Huh? What? Oh my god, this could not be any worse. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, what the fuck? <gasps> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I'm laughing, but I'm also crying. What? Oh my. Oh my god, this is bad. This might be the worst lock picking I've ever done. Even Oblivion lock picking is better. Because that thing actually, you know, at least works. Oh no. What the hell? Really? What? Ah! What? I swear to God, I'm not doing that. That is like the game doing that. What the fuck? No. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. Oh my oh my fucking god. Oh my god, this is Oh Jesus. I'm actually getting I feel like I'm getting brain damage just by playing this. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? There it is. Don't move a finger. How do you know? You're under arrest. How do you know? How do you know? What the actual fuck? How do you know? There, wait, there is no one. There was no one! What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, this is so bad! <laughs> this is so unbelievably bad!
take. Guys, like, I do not think that there is... I, I honestly don't think, like, I need to explain myself, like... Like, this could not be worse. Like, this legitimately could not be any worse. Like, I, I, I'm trying to think of... How could you do this any worse? Is he not gonna let me? My respects to you. I need to get out of here. Then I'm afraid you're out of luck. Ah, I see. All right then. But if you breathe a word about me. This game is such a shame. And you know, it would be cool if I could save now, but you know, you cannot. We need to go on... Let's have a look. We need to go on this road here. Go like this. Oh, that is, that is gonna be... By the wall. Oh my god, it is quite a walk. Well, while it is quite a walk, uh, we better start going, I guess. Stalker taught me. The best way how to get somewhere is to get somewhere. So let's just get somewhere, I guess. What? Got you. What? Will you never give up? Let me go for Christ's sake. I have to bury my parents. What the fuck? Going nowhere except back inside. But how do you know? If I don't bury them now, they'll be ripped to pieces by jackdaws and What the fuck? Why can I do this now? I I throw away. All right, shove me. I'll pretend you caught me off guard and I fell over. What is this cutscene? We are one. We became one. Kurva! Die! Kurva. <laughs> so in the end, it really didn't matter. It, it honestly didn't matter whether I got myself, you know, the gear or not. I just want to get the fuck out of here. Why why is this so difficult? And it's not difficult because it would be like, you know, like challenging. It's difficult because it's very badly done, like horribly badly done. It feels like the people who work on this never made a game before. This is like the first game. Like here I am, you know, doing the whole fucking Well, the armor doesn't matter because, you know, if I go, if I'm gonna get into a fight, I'm just gonna die. But they try to keep you there because I don't know because they are retards. Look at how many guards! What? Fuck off! Are you serious? I actually cannot get over. I cannot get over this. Are you real? Really? Okay, again, if I fight it a little, god damn it. Oh 
Oh my god, I'm so close. I, I actually cannot believe just how close. You know, I was like, you know, like, I'm really happy. What? Okay, okay, I give up. I give up. I give up. Give me a second. Give me a second. Give me a second. Uh, give me a second. Give me a second, I need something. Okay. Okay, give me a second. Let's just add this screen so yeah so this was uh kingdom come deliverance uh it's a really bad game like it's a really bad game like i broke both legs by the way like this game probably had the best you know what, give me a second. I'm just gonna start some picture music because I kinda wanna I I I kinda wanna explain everything wrong. So and music. Yes. Yeah. Let's have let's have music from a much better game. Okay, so I'm gonna explain. So the first two hours of this game were really good. They were ridiculously good. But then, the whole, you need to get armor. So, if the game was good, once you actually get the armor, no one would be able to tell who you are. And I was running around in the armor, you know, I literally, even the game was like, you know, you got the, you got the quest, you know, the game was like, you fulfilled the task. But then, the game was like, also, by the way, they can still tell. Uh, that was really bad. Also, my character breaking legs after dropping, like, a half a meter makes no sense. That is not how human bodies work. Like, you do not break your fucking legs after dropping, like, like a fucking meter. That is not how this fucking works. Oh my god. The bugs are insane. The stuttering is absolutely insane. Uh, just the horrible optimization of this game is just horrifying. Again, I am willing to ignore horrible FPS and bugs and such. I have played the Daggerfall. Daggerfall is one of the buggiest games I've played in my entire life. But I'm not willing. I'm not willing to fight with some of the worst quest design I've seen in my entire life. Like, that is so bad that if I was a tester, I would immediately tell them, did they not test it? Everybody I've seen this really doesn't like this game. Well, it's because of shit. It's like, it's like, okay, just once this stream is over, or oh, when this is on YouTube. Just skip the first two hours of the stream. Where the game is really nice, really interesting. You know, the story is interesting, the music is nice, the history aspect of the game is nice. But like, skip all of that. And just see my suffering after the second hour of the game. It's insane. It's absolutely mentally... Like, it actually makes me wonder if the developers were mentally challenged. Like... It feels like someone has made the two hours of this game, the first two hours, and then someone else made the rest. Be that's how different it feels. Because like, suddenly the level design, and I'm gonna call it the level design because I know it's a world, but I'm gonna call it level design. The level design gets shit. Absolute dog shit. I watch you try to unlock the box and then God just burst through and just like stop. <laughs> That's about where I came in. Yeah. 
that's not even all of it. Like, I tried... So, you know how they immediately knew who I was? So, before the, before the whole me getting the armor thing, I actually tried to run away without the armor. And... Take a guess. They immediately knew. But, you know, at that point I was like, okay, that makes sense. Because I'm not wearing the armor, I didn't get the attire, you know. I didn't get anything. But after this... It basically, I got the armor, and I went outside, they still could tell immediately, and there were so many guards. And again, it makes sense that there would be so many guards, but why would you even get the armor if, you know, it doesn't change anything? It doesn't change jack fucking squat. That's how bad it is. So yeah. This is Kingdom Come uh, Deliverance. I thought that this game is gonna be good because, you know, I fucking live in the country that this game was made in. I had high hopes. I was willing to basically ignore some of the problems of this game. I really was. But I just cannot ignore this, the third and fourth hour of this game. It's absolutely mentally bad. So yeah, this has been Fingrisa playing Kingdom Come. Or more like never come because this is real bad. Goodbye.